The struggle is real, you guys. I'm at Walmart. It is 9.30 at night. I have a hard time walking, so I'm gonna get that thing. That thing you sit in in the store. I made it. You made it. So hard. You're out of breath. Okay, I'm on the cart, you guys. Should be alright for a little while. You got a little cart. Last time I was on the cart, I was with Tyshawn in Wally World. That was a while back ago. I haven't seen Tyshawn in forever. Yo, that's really gross. I'm curious. Chocolate frosted flakes. I can't see nothing. We're looking at the little 24 inch TV. Uh, oh, that's a small TV. They put some new stuff on the table. I'm so tired. I'm ready to go home and go to bed. I took my eyelashes off. Mm -hmm. No games. No games. I sleeping. See my makeup is all smeared. Hey, 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 it's your girl Jasmine. So today I'm actually going to get holy crab. Um so Holy Crab is one of those places where you get like seafood and you can pig out on it and all that good stuff like crab legs with the uh, garlic butter and everything like that. Um, so today the reason why I'm getting that is because in a month I will be getting my surgery. I got my surgery date. And so being able to pig out on food will no longer be an option but I don't care because diabetes sucks. <laughs> it stinks so badly, you guys. So I am here. Um, I'm so hungry. I, yeah, I'm so hungry. So I decided to, you know, eat some of the meals that I want to eat before I have to get my surgery. So just works out for me, you know. And, um, I'll probably be eating a lot of them alone because, you know, um, eating out could be expensive and I don't feel like paying for anybody's meals but my own. So, therefore, I'll be going to all the restaurants that I want to before my surgery alone. So, that's how it is right now. But yeah, the restaurant does not open for another half an hour, so I'm in my car. And I'm probably gonna fall asleep for like 30 minutes. All right, so I set up like a crab boil. So I have the paper, the newspaper on the tables. You guys have been waiting half an hour in my car. Ugh, I'm tired, I can't wait to go home. My phone is dying, so. It's in my purse because I still need the GPS how to get the highway. Um, and I left my charger at home because I was like, oh yeah, let me just leave my charger. So dumb. I don't know why I did that because now I need to charge my phone and I can't. And I still need to at least use my GPS enough to get me on the highway. Because once I'm on the highway, I know how to get home. But um, before the highway, no, I don't know how to get home. Alright, let's get this bed over. That's crazy. Lord, my camera. Come on, bib on. I'm ready. I'm ready. 
You guys, I'm so ready for my gastro bypass surgery. It's not even funny. I'm ready. I'm ready for the change of life, actually. And to be able to fully see again and to be able to have better feet <laughs> again, hopefully that will heal to the best of its ability. See you guys in my food kissing. Uh, I'm so excited. You guys, this is no game. It is corn, potato, shrimp, everything. Ooh. Yeah, the choices of some of my last meals are gonna be amazing. Mm. I know I'll still be able to eat food, but it's the fact that I won't be able to eat like this. You know, it'll be smaller portions. But, you know, my health is very important. <laughs> so, I'm going to go in. Alright guys, I did that put around my whole bag. So, now I'm going to take this and I'm going to head home. I'm going to sleep all day because that's what I'm going to do. And I already prepped the meals for the boys later. I'm making them some teriyaki noodles with uh, broccoli and chicken and shrimp. I mean, chicken and steak. Because they okay and have shrimp. Alright, you guys. See me again. God bless.